Nathan Judah. I'm here with Wolves reporter Tim Spears. And Tim, another nil-nil draw at home, and I've got nothing at the moment, so you're going to have to talk. I can either. <laughs> Should we finish it now? Yeah, let's finish it now. Let's cut it. It was just it was terrible, wasn't it? it was, well, apart from the last 15 minutes, um, but you missed the best bit when you went off to speak to the fans. Just okay. full, 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 full time, it got, got slightly exciting in the time. Um, but before then, it was just dreadful. I mean, there were so many. Somebody just said they thought it was the worst first half of the season. No, I've, I've um, had that quite a few times today as well. well, I remember, well we've had it a few times this season. Yeah. That's a bold play, to be honest. There's so plenty of contenders for that. But yeah, it was, it was right up there. I mean, it was very poor. Um, they were so hesitant. They, they took an extra touch at every opportunity. Um, they didn't want to shoot. So they just wanted to pass it around the box. Yeah. Um, it was just no excitement. I mean. They're going nowhere. They're not, they're not going up. They're not going down. You would have thought this would be the, the, the prime opportunity to just go and play with a bit of freedom, try and build for next season. But it almost looks like they're scared. They're just, they're, you know, I don't know what, what's going wrong. Um, I don't know about scared. I just feel like they've got nothing to play for. Yeah. Um, so the season's naturally going to peter out. I mean, mm-hmm. you know, just because they've got nothing to play for doesn't mean they're going to suddenly produce, you know, Barcelona-style football and play to their potential because you know you play to your potential when you've got someone to play for yeah. and you know there's not that much competition for places really um, the whole the whole this apathy just kind of surrounds the place there's, mm-hmm. there's, there's nothing coming from the fans and that's not a dig at the fans by the way but it was so quiet the first time yeah. because they've got nothing to feed off either um, so it's all it's all it's all dull it's just, it's just boring do you think it's from the top down because the club's in limbo and, it, and it's not just just outwardly, but, but on the pitch, they look like they're in limbo as well. I don't know whether they're coming or going, really. Yeah, I think the, the tactics didn't help, and the, 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 the selection of Sigurd Arsenal on the right just, just didn't work. And yeah. The Wolves had no potency to speak of, did they, on front? No. Um, so, and, and from midfield, their passing wasn't as, as crisp as, as at all as it was against Burnley a couple of weeks ago. The international break really didn't help them. You know, they wanted a game a week last Tuesday, you know, straight after Burnley. But, um, Two week break has kind of killed them not for the first time this season. Um, so, you know, Kenny's, Kenny's been talking about optimism and giving hope for the future for a while now, but it's, 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 not, it's not happening on the field. Seven games to go now, which we're now on the end of the season. What, what do you want to see from Wolves? Um, <laughs> <laughs> how long have you got? Well, yeah, um, honestly, we've got, we've got a bleed button, so. <laughs> um, you, you want to see some, some entertaining football, you want to see some victories. See, you want to see players playing for their futures, as, as a lot of them are, really. Yeah. Um, you want you want to see a, a, some some dynamism up front. Um, you want to see some goals. I mean, just just anything rather than the, that kind of turgid, hesitant, one-paced football, which, yeah. which we saw today. Yeah, I don't blame many people making the trip to MK Dons uh, in midweek, but we will be there. And for the post-match reaction on this nil-nil stalemate, make, make sure you log on to expressandstar.com.